guys and welcome back to my channel thank you so much for tuning in welcome to another vlog if it is your first time here i'm vicky and welcome i hope that you will choose to stay and click that subscribe button down below so today i'm starting a new vlog and i'm doing a very quick intro because i am late so i am going out for dinner with my colleagues today i'm already late like ridiculously late we are meeting at half past five and it's like 25 past five but um we're not going far it's just like 10 minutes away so i'll be 10 to 15 minutes late so i just wanted to quickly introduce this vlog i have to rush um i will see you guys when i get to the restaurant dinner that i had with my colleagues last night i'm not even sure if i did justice with vlogging yesterday because i i just couldn't i was with people and obviously trying to respect their privacy as well as certain boundaries so i tried to vlog as best as i could i hope that you guys did enjoy the small dinner clip with them so today i came back to a package from yours beauty they sent me a little self-care package i really really love this if this is their new packaging then it is super stunning this is how it looks like so when it's closed it is like this there's this transparent plastic thing here so let's see what's inside there is um jojoba oil it is a radiance boost oil i have tried their almond oil before and my skin didn't react well to it so i'm looking forward to trying this one and see if my skin will love it or not so this is a um a radiance boost face oil the jojoba oil and it's 100 percent natural the second product that they sent is this um under eye sheet masks i have never tried them before so i'm really excited these launched like months ago so these are the hydrate and deep half 0.5 percent hyaluronic acid honey hydrate um under eye masks this is what they look like also sent me their vanilla moisture body scrub a gentle exfoliant for smoother soft skin i am super excited for this one as well and they also sent me my face bath salt 
this time it's the pure epsom salt bath soak this is just pure epsom salt i have used other bath salts i forgot what they are called but let me quickly check yells beauty so i just checked now and the ones that i've used are called himalayan bath salt so i have tried those ones before i haven't used pure epsom salt as yet but i'm really excited i do love soaking myself in a nice bubble bath with some salt it is so relaxing this is from their bath and body collection and the star of the show which is the product that they just launched is this cleansing balm it's called melt my day away cleansing balm this is what it looks like melt my day away cleansing balm i love the packaging so stunning so this is what it looks like so this um melt my day away balm is a cleansing balm to remove like many layers of spf that we apply throughout the day as well as makeup if you are a makeup person i'm not a makeup person i'm sure you guys definitely know that however i'm going to use it to remove the layers of spf that i apply daily but also next week i am going for a photo shoot a very exciting photo shoot i'll be taking you guys along so i will definitely need makeup um so i'm going to apply makeup and then we're gonna try and test this cleansing balm with um to see if it is effective with removing makeup or not but yeah i'm really excited we'll use it then i'm so excited for that photo shoot by the way i will tell you guys soon in this vlog but the products that i'm most excited to use from this um self-care box they sent me are these hydrate and deep half under eye masks as well as the bath salts i do love all oh, oh actually and this body scrub actually i'm excited to try everything that they sent me here so yeah that's what i wanted to show you guys today not doing anything like i said before i don't really have much to vlog so i don't want to try and vlog and force content when there's no content but whatever little chance that i get to vlog i do vlog so yeah this is what we were doing today just the unboxing i'll see you guys when you see me hi guys and welcome back welcome to another day i got my hair done i got my hair done yesterday oh my goodness i went to the saloon i didn't vlog that because i was just too tired like i was not in the mood for vlogging yesterday but yeah i got my hair at the same saloon where i got the previous braids that i had and once again i am very happy this is what i asked for and they delivered just exactly that so yeah i really really love the hair the only thing i dislike is that they pulled my hair quite too much so i'm a little bit worried about my hairline but i will like try to do something to prevent it from being damaged so yeah i will try and take care of it as soon as today to prevent breakage but besides that they pulled my hair a little bit too much than what i usually prefer i really do love the hairstyle so today is a very special day i am invited to the um Cetaphil sensitive skin range visual launch did i say it correctly and they sent me a press pack yesterday for the virtual launch so i'm gonna show you guys what's inside they sent me the moisturizing cream for face and body that is for dry as well as sensitive skin here it is then they also sent me one of my favorite cleansers which is the gentle skin cleanser for face and body and this one is for all skin types including sensitive skin here it is i am really excited this is my first um event so i am so excited i'm looking forward to it 
like i am so happy you guys you guys don't know how happy i am they do have a third product in this range which is the moisturizing lotion they didn't send me that one because i have i told them that i have dry skin so they had to send the cream because it provides long lasting hydration I tried wearing a color that sort of like goes in with a few colors that Seraphil uses if you see they use um royal blue i do have a royal blue t-shirt however i looked for it and i couldn't find it i wanted to wear it but this one is fine it still works yeah i need to post an Instagram story. Okay, so I'm about to attend the set of full complete care for sensitive skin virtual launch campaign and I am super excited. doing my makeup but i couldn't now i'm calling my mom she's not picking up anyway um as i was saying i had a very busy morning i did my makeup as you guys can see that i am setting face today i am not sure though i i'm just not used to my face and makeup but yeah i think i look good she did a very good job um bits by gang did my makeup i leave her instagram handle on the screen so i'm sure you guys are asking yourselves what is the occasion <laughs> yeah i'm getting married <laughs> i'm getting married today so yeah <laughs> i'm joking <laughs> i'm joking guys so for those of you who don't know i finished my qualification in 2019 and was supposed to graduate last year in 2020 but because of covid like graduations got cancelled so we didn't have graduations at all so i made time today that my family and i are going to come and take um graduation photos for myself and them so yeah that is the occasion i had to make sure that i look nice i was wearing a mask for like a very long time so i feel like it did remove like some of the makeup but i still look good anyway i love my face so much so yeah and i went to hire a gown as well as a hood here they are i've worked all my life to wear this attire and covid did not afford me 
the opportunity to but at least i will today and get to take um graduation pictures with my family they are on the way our appointment is at 11 o'clock and it's 20 minutes before 11 now so they are still on time I'm waiting for them in the meantime i'm gonna go inside to like fill in forms if i need to i think i need to though so yeah i'm gonna do that i'm not sure if i'll vlog six now we had a very long day after the shoot we went to eat like i said and i didn't vlog that just wanted to be with my family so you guys know that we received a pr drop from yours beauty a few days ago and one of the products that they sent is this melt away melt my day away um cleansing balm they say that it's a makeup and SPF remover for all skin types. So I wanted to um, try it today because I have a face bit. So I might as well use this opportunity. I never get a face bit done. This is like my first face bit in two years. So yeah, I thought we should give it a try and see how it removes makeup. So directions, they say that you massage for 30 to 60 seconds over makeup or bare skin, rinse off with warm water and remove any residue with a warm damp cloth. Follow up with a face wash for a deeper cleansed fresh face. So yeah, I'm going to just massage it on my skin as they say for 30 to 60 seconds, rinse with warm water, remove with a damp cloth and then I will show you guys the results it has this little i don't know if it's an applicator or spatula something like that how much do you use by the way So 
so um i just rinsed my face now hope you guys can clearly see yes so i just um rinsed my face and this is how my skin looks it did um remove the makeup this is just before like i haven't done another cleanse like i haven't used a face wash just the cleansing balm then rinsing off the makeup is off even my um eyeshadow is off the eyebrows are off so yeah that's the job so i am now gonna go in with my second normal cleanser and i'm using the benzic ac5 wash i'm trying not to get a breakout maybe from the makeup reaction i'm already seeing a little bit of a rash on my forehead or maybe i'm just overreacting but yeah this is what i'm using to wash my face then i'm going to mask um clay mask sheet mask then that's it i'm not gonna show you guys all of that i'm sure you've seen like enough of my skincare routine already so yeah just wanted to show you guys which second cleanser i am using then from here i'm going to sleep i will see you guys another day i don't know when but yeah later after the last time that you guys saw me so it's friday today decided to use this day to just relax um have some therapy i need it i am so tired my body is exhausted so as you guys saw i went to take a lot pick a point i had something to pick up but i will show you guys when i get home so now i'm at kailami corner i have to work then after work saying i'm gonna go to the mall i don't know what i want well i know i want a bag i want a specific bag so we're gonna go buy that i don't know what else i'm gonna buy we'll see and then maybe i will have lunch then head home because i'm gonna have lunch at the mall or do a takeaway i will see it'll depend on what time it is and it is so cloudy um when i left it was not this cloudy it was sunny like the sky was clearing the sun was out so i left some laundry <laughs> on the line so i'm just praying and crossing fingers that it does not rain until i get home but by the looks of it it's definitely going to rain so yeah but it's fine i will rinse it again later or just so get inside the machine and hang it again tomorrow it's not a train smash so yeah i'm going to work i'm not taking you guys along you guys already know where i wax so yeah also guys i was thinking earlier to myself that I have gotten used to waxing to a point where I now look forward to it. Like I become excited when it's time for me to go wax. Like the pain is not I don't like I don't feel the pain the same way that I used to feel it. I don't know if that makes sense. It's sort of like a pleasurable pain. <laughs> but yeah like i've gotten so used to it i know it may sound crazy but i'm excited like i'm looking forward to it for the pain and also the therapist that i booked with today i absolutely love her like she is amazing if i'm waxing with her i know that it's going to be and she like she does an amazing job shame like give her a 10 out of 10 so i booked with her today maybe that's why i'm looking forward to it and not like getting cold feet so yeah <laughs>
I decided to have a takeaway for the mom. I asked for guacamole on the side, then fries as well. And there's a burger. I've been craving this spice for since yesterday actually. So I'm so happy. I can't wait to dig in. It looks here. Yeah. So I'm gonna eat now. And then I'll show you guys what I bought. I'm gonna put some of this in here. unboxing my take a lot order with you guys so I bought a mic but a vlogging mic or a camera mic rather and I'm so excited my audio will finally improve after I don't know how many years of starting this channel but yeah but this mic it's by Boya. I think it's called Boya. Uh, it connects to your phone, it connects to your iPad, connects to the laptop, and it connects to the camera as well. I love that whether I want to vlog with my phone or with my camera, I can still use it. So I'm going to show it to you guys now, then we'll connect it to the camera. It looks so small than what I was expecting that's the thing about buying things online right? so it comes with this i think this is what you put on the camera it comes with a little pouch to insert the mic you can see how small the mic is by just looking at this pouch then it has a cable i think this is for there's one that you can use on the phone then there's one for the camera i don't know which one is for the phone and which one is for the camera they look the same though but i will see they should have indicated somewhere which one is for the phone and which one is for the camera but it's fine i'll figure that out and this is the mic i think this can be removed because this is for when you're vlogging outside i think and then the, you can remain with the mic that is inside but yeah you will see i removed the mic because i'm trying to record with it and there is no audio so i will try and figure that out later so i went to h and m and i bought this cute shoulder bag it has um safari animals prints as well as palm trees Print. so it's giving me safari vibes as well as island living vibes and i do have like a few trips in the coming weeks so i thought that this bag would be a nice addition to my travel essentials which is why i got it i absolutely love it got this at h&m and it was 430 rands it is so big it has a lot of space as you guys can see so i can easily like slide in a beach towel can slide in my camera i can slide in some sunscreen without um it feeling heavy or being too full then i also went to edgar's and got a pair of sandals these are the shoes that i got they are so stunning let me show you guys just one they are so stunning got them in size four they are white in color and they have this um little 
lapels like design over here and i also love like the shape of the sole like it has a very nice design don't know if you can tell on the camera but absolutely love these i got them from edgar's and they were 199 rands they were 200 so i absolutely absolutely love 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 these i wish there were like more colors maybe black or purple i was definitely gonna get them in another color so yeah those are the only things that i got i also wanted like a nice sun hat but um i didn't find any that sparked my soul so maybe i will go back to the mall in a few days and just shop a little bit again today i was just so exhausted i had not eaten breakfast in the morning so i didn't have like the energy to do a whole run around in the mall trying to shop for one or two items so yeah i will definitely go back in a few days i'm not sure if i should end this vlog here or continue tomorrow for the last time i think we should continue tomorrow i don't know i just feel like if i continue there's going to be a lot of things happening in the vlog no i will definitely close the vlog tomorrow tomorrow is saturday or sunday so yeah see you guys tomorrow or on sunday